there once again welcome back to my youtube channel in today's tutorial i'm going to show you how to use the facebook business suite the facebook business suite allows you to manage your instagram and then facebook pages together within the same accounts so from my facebook business suite i have my instagram and then the facebook page is connected but before you can use this you need to make sure you connect both accounts together so when you go to facebook in order to connect your instagram page to your facebook page go to settings click on settings when you click on settings at the far left corner just click on instagram remember we have a mobile app for this for android as well as ios so you can download that and equally do the same once you have instagram page just click on settings go to instagram and then connect the two accounts together on instagram you have the option here to connect your instagram account so i've already connected my own so if i scroll down here you can see there's option to disconnect this by my case i don't want to disconnect this so make sure you have your instagram account connected to your facebook page if you have that connected then you can go ahead and then start using the facebook if you have that connected you can go ahead and start using the facebook business suite okay so if you are using the desktop version then within your account just go to the far left corner and then click on more under the apps click on more when you click on more just scroll down and then you see the the meta business suite so just open that and it should be getting something like this so it's going to give you an overview of the performance of your facebook and then the instagram pages so you can see from the menu of it, we have the notification inbox posts and stories planner ads insight and everything so i'm just going to take you through a few of this and let's see how best you can use it to manage your business okay so if i click on insight for instance let's look at the insight and performance of our business pages when i click on insights it's going to give you an overview of the performance of your facebook page as well as your instagram page you can set goals as well so if you look at the past eight days my facebook page reached over two hundred thousand people as well as the ig page also reached 1900 so you can see the performance of this page just an overview of that and you can look at your top performing posts on your pages okay so this allows you to manage both accounts you can see down here as well i can see my facebook followers which is about two thousand which is about seven thousand two hundred and eighty three then ig thousand three hundred and eight so this is just an overview within the inside you can also check results by clicking on the results section so you can see you can just view just the results of our performance in the past 28 days you can also, also narrow down to maybe seven days or specific a custom duration okay so you can see the visit to my page that's my facebook page and the last for 28 days that's about 603 and then my ig page is around 22 and then they reach over here so you can look at that and you can also view your content that you posted and look at how they are performing and one specific thing which is very important is the audience so when i click on audience so basically when i click on audience i'll still see my followers and then the instagram page as well but this is going to give me a breakdown of where my audience are coming from the agenda as well so if you move down here it's going to give you a breakdown for both ig and what instagram pages you can also view potential audience so this allows you to be able to manage your business so you can see down here i can see the percentage of my audience where they you can see down here i can see the percentage of my audience where they are coming from and that of instagram and that of facebook pages as well so i'll be able to monitor where my audience are coming from and this will even allow me to know what to post as well so this app will help you a lot to be able to manage your business page you can also look at schedule posts you can also read posts from both accounts so let's go back to our menu your menu you when you click on the inbox you'll be able to read messages from all your messaging applications from facebook messenger as well as well from instagram so you can see down here there are messages coming from instagram some coming from what Instagram or just for what? Facebook Messenger. And you can also read comments made under your post. 
You don't need to go to the individual pages and be doing that. You can manage everything within the Facebook business suite. You can do that for Instagram as well. And then you can compose a message. So you can see there are comments under my post I made on Facebook. So I can reply to that directly from here. So it's amazing how to manage this using this amazing application. Okay. So if you go back to your menu, So from your menu as well, we have posts and stories. So if you want to create posts for both Instagram and then Facebook, you can go ahead and then click on posts and stories. Click on posts and stories. You have option to create posts and also view your previous post. So you can also schedule posts. Posts that you schedule, you can easily view that. So let's click on what create post. So realize that when you click on create post, you can make posts for Instagram and then what Facebook at the same time. Okay. You can schedule posts. Once you create a post, you can schedule when you want to publish that post. You can also save it to draft as well. So let's say, for instance, we want to create a post and then we just go ahead and type whatever post you want to make. This is also going to give us a real time preview of the post we are going to make. So if I type in something, you can go ahead and then add images to your post and all that. So if I type this, it's going to give me a preview of whatever post I made. Okay. And once you publish this post, it's going to appear on both Instagram and what Facebook. So I can go ahead and add images to your post as well. When you click, you can upload from desktop. I'll just select any image at all from my desktop just to show you how this is going to look like. So I'll select and then click on what I'll select image and then click on what open. This you can compose a nice message about this. Schedule this message and then you can see a live preview of how your post is going to look like before you even publish it. You can view this on desktop and mobile version and see how people view your post on a desktop device as well as what a mobile device. So this is how it's going to appear on mobile device to people. And then this is how it's going to appear. And this is going to appear on desktop. So you can schedule. So when you click on schedule, you can specify when you want to publish this post. You can also save to draft. So this post, anytime I publish this post, is going to show on my Instagram and Facebook pages as well. So there are several things you can do with this particular amazing Facebook business suite. So try and then play around it. You can link the two accounts together and you can start scheduling messages and post and you can easily reply to comment on your posts right from these applications. You can easily reply to posts and everything from this application. It will help you a lot. We also have the planner, the ads. You can run ads directly from this application. And the video is going to be very long if I want to run through all this. So this is just an introductory video to the Facebook business suite. Just take a look at it and see how best you can try this to manage your business or Facebook and then Instagram pages and see how best this will help you to grow your business. This is going to release your stress on how to manage your accounts okay if you have a lot of accounts you can easily use this to group all of them together within the same application and then you can easily go ahead and then manage them thank you so much remember to like subscribe and don't forget to turn on post notifications